Decided to make a shorter video simply showing uh, the functionality of my table saw fence. Uh, if you're not interested in building it, then you don't have to watch the whole 15 minute one. Um, so basically I have a chunk of four inch aluminum that was machined down to match the threads. And I'm using a one inch eight thread per inch. Um, so we had it machined down, whole board in the side, half inch for a spring and a steel ball. Then it was uh, machined out one millimeter for the surface of the bearing to sit against. And then uh, brought into this two inch or inch and a half diameter. So this assembly, this side piece slides in and out of this tube. By pulling on the lever. So you push it down and it's got a uh, one by two bearing in there and just a piece of cold roll. Um, slides pretty nicely. I've got uh, guides right here, right here, and there's another set in here that work as a wedge. The further you push it in, the tighter it actually makes it. So there is no movement at all. Okay, so when you want to engage it, Simply go to the number that you want. Say it's three inch. So I'm pretty close to it right there. It should be close enough to engage. Should be able to see it just pull over. Now if I need to take off a little bit more. Moves, well, 1 64th of an inch. Second, two sixty fourths, back to the one sixteen. So you can see the guides right here. Without those, it had uh, way too much play in there, but it moves pretty easily. So now I'm going to cut a piece, uh, let's say at uh, three inches. Let's uh, see how accurate it is. Okay, let's go ahead and slide it over to the uh, two inch mark. Make another cut and let's uh, see how accurate it is. Try one more at one inch.
So the accuracy is going to depend on your threaded rod. Uh, if you didn't uh, measure it ahead of time, you'll end up with buying another one, like I had to do. Uh, thanks for watching.